San Francisco is home to many diverse Southeast Asian cultures. This week's Jefferson Award winner has a passion for celebrating them through colorful community events. Sharon Chin joins us now. I recently heard Laotian organ tunes, watched Mongolian dancers, and salivated over Vietnamese spring rolls all in one place, thanks to Hang Lei To. From lively Laotian music to meditative Tai Chi, the Mid-Autumn Harvest Festival highlights the richness of the Southeast Asian culture at the Tenderloin Recreation Center and Children's Playground. Hang Lei To helped start this event six years ago since many immigrant families live in the neighborhood. They just want to share the culture, who we are, who they are. What they do. Yeah, yeah, Thank, yeah, you. Yeah. Thank you. Okay. Thank you, buddy. Hang coordinates the festival as part of the Southeast Asian Arts and Culture Coalition she co founded in 2011. It represents diverse ethnic groups like Burmese, Cambodian, Filipino, and Thai, to name a few. Coalition co founder Serge Chantiasak praises Hang's dedication. She's focused and determined, and, and she wants um, uh, the Tenderloin to, to, to be a strong community and, and to preserve the uh, bedrock of the Southeast Asian community that immigrated to this area. People acknowledge that. 30 years ago, Hang was a teenager arriving in the U.S. as a Vietnamese refugee. She teared up, recalling how others looked down on her. We, we, we were very worried that people um, look at us as like a Vietnamese, as a gang member. That's how they label us. So, um, so that's a hard time. Now as an adult, she encourages others to embrace their heritage. <laughs> So it brings her joy coordinating the Faces of Asia procession, where hundreds of people dress in their cultural attire at San Francisco's annual Asian Heritage Street celebration. I love to see uh, people wearing their costumes and proud of themselves and who they are. Hang also applies for grants, securing as much as $35,000 a year so that these community festivals can be put on free to the public. And these eight-year-old girls can be free to share their Mongolian dances. I feel like really proud of ourselves. Thank you, thank you. <laughs> so for leading Southeast Asian community events to promote cultural diversity and ethnic pride, this week's Jefferson Award in the Bay Area goes to Hang Lei To. Hang also volunteers as executive director of the OCO Vietnamese Cultural Center in San Francisco. It offers free Saturday language and cultural history classes at Martin Luther King Middle School. Pretty cool. Fantastic. So, yeah. Yeah. Much needed. Sharon, thank you for that. Thank you, sure. Sharon. And you can nominate your local hero for a Jefferson Award online at cbssf.com slash hero.